Okay, so I'm about empty here. It's going to be sucking dry here in a minute. And uh, I'm going to unplug my pump. Putting in five gallons at a time. I've got my case right here. It's starting to starting to suck some air here. Okay. There we go. We'll suck some more out of there. And I'm going to show you how you can tell how much you got in the tire. Hang on. Okay, first we're going to let the air out. It's going to back out there. So uh, the air that's been pumping up in the tire, as you put in the liquid, it compresses the air in the tire, and you got to let that air out. That compressed air, so you have um, less air resistance as you're pumping liquid into the tire. And you can turn your tire, like I'm turning my tire down here now. You can turn it, and when it stops blowing air, okay, stop blowing air here. So that tells me, you can see, that my tire's half full of water. And I tip it up. start filling again and I'm going to fill it to about the 80% mark and the reason I'm going to fill it to the 80% mark is so I have some air cushion in the tire so otherwise if you fill it all the way up it wouldn't be a problem except for your ride is real rock hard and you don't want a rock hard ride you want some cushion so okay I'm going to shut this puppy off here and go ahead and fill up some more of this. By the way, if you guys are wondering what you can get me for Christmas, as I've been doing this, I think, you know what I need? I need a uh, uh, tripod that'll hold my phone and uh, maybe a wireless speaker so I can be away from the phone and talk as a recording. So, still air coming out of there. I'm gonna wait till it's done blown air so I can start pumping again. Okay, talk to you later.